hi guys welcome back to mmi so guys in this video we are going to learn the chassis frame construction in an automobile so guys a chassis is nothing but the skeleton which supports the engine block and other auxiliary such as the doors bumpers and other equipments in an automobile so guys this is a simple representation of a particular chassis so we have over here this uh, longitudinal uh, ones longitudinal bars or uh, we can call it as a longitudinal frames which are connected to the particular cross uh, cross ones which are nothing but the cross frames on we can call it as a cross members basically so guys these cross members are connected to the longitudinal ones by the means of this particular boltings and uh, welded also so so when generally the 5 to 6 cross members are used to get the good stability and a good strength to the chassis frame so the uh, the more the number of the cross members the more the strength and the stability sometimes uh, this cross frames are provided in a diagonal cross pressing such as in a x shape particularly so we have got the good strength and good stability over here in this case also which uh, which provides the high torsional rigidity in the this case so hence the torsional rigidity test has been carried out on the chassis frame to sustain the sudden load conditions such as the impacts and accidents so guys this is the visualized uh, 3d model visualized uh, in this particular chassis so this uh, areas shows us the high concentration region uh, in particular 3d model so guys uh, this section represents the strongest sections as visualized in that particular 3d software so the next one we have got over here a chassis we are uh, this is the longitudinal frames and which are connected to the cross ones also so this longitudinal uh, members are up straight in front and rear guys so which is the uh, you know which is for the movement of this axle that is the front axle and rear axle due to the springing effects so guys this is the axle and this is the spring basically connected so this this is the springing and this space is provided for the springing effect that is basically for the suspension known as the springing space this is uh, given in the both front and rear axles as well so guys also this uh, longitudinal frames are uh, tapered from uh, rear to front so to provide us the better steering uh, block and for the smaller diameter turns so guys uh, uh, this there the next comes is the brackets which are provided for the basically for the mounting and f to the chassis so this these are the nothing but the brackets which are provided for the mounting so this is the 3d model i have shown over here and this is the uh, the actual one how does it looks like which is bolted also as the uh, we can sometimes it is welded so these brackets are to support and mounting for particular suspension springs sometimes uh, uh, spring engine blocks also and uh, sometimes in the auxiliaries also so guys this uh, extension in the front of the chassis frame ahead of the front axle is known as the front overhang so this particular space ahead of this front axle is the front overhang whereas uh, in the rear axle which is also same this is we have got over here uh, rear overhang so guys that was all about the chassis frame thank you for watching this particular video guys uh, if you have if you want some more information uh, please do contact us also please do subscribe us to our channel we'll be uploading the sub such as su these uh, such videos so after subscribing please press this particular bell icon so you will get notified of my latest videos so thank you guys